Hi, my friends. I get this question a lot, so I'm gonna be breaking down how I create Harmony Builders. First, I'll break down the gear. As you can see, I've got a Shure SM7B microphone. That is what I record with. And for some extra power, I've got a cloud lifter. Everything is connected to a Focusrite interface, which is all connected because I just recorded one. And then for my headphones, I have these Bayer Dynamic DT770 Pro, uh, 80 ohm. These are really great, really, really comfortable, so I can, I can record and edit and my ears don't get sore. I record all of my audio in Logic Pro. As you can see here, I start with the bass and then I add tenor, I add alto and soprano. And by the way, I don't record bass four times. I record it once and then copy and paste. The next step is to mix it all together. I'm no expert in this, but really what I'm doing is making sure everything is cohesive, that I bring out the moments that I wanna bring out and quiet the moments that I don't really wanna bring out. Then once I have the mix finished, I'll export and then I'll set up my camera and I'll film myself doing the whole thing in one take. Sometimes you may have to memorize the music, but if it's only like 10 measures, it's actually pretty simple. Once I film everything to my liking, I bring it over to Premiere Pro where I edit the video. Most of what I record is four parts, so I just split the screen into four, and then I just put four of me on the screen, and that's pretty much it. What's helpful for me is if I listen to a really high quality recording before I record, so I'll listen to like John Elliott Gardner, or I'll listen to Tafel music or something like that to get, get a feel for the song before I actually record it. And that's it. Stay tuned for more Harmony Builders.